What is going on guys and welcome back to episode 2 of our Pixelmon server let's play What's going on guys? How you doing? Hello? Hello? Oh that's pretty sweet Look at that Tortera Like a boss Look at that thing You can ride those things around it Looks pretty sweet Hopefully he'll do it Will you do it? Will you ride it around for us? Come on show us Show us dude that's not even the right guy, I don't think. But anyways, guys, welcome to episode two. Uh, in episode one, we did manage to capture up a Nidoran male uh, level 11 here. Uh, Mudkip, we didn't manage to level him up, which is highly unfortunate, and he's actually fainted. So let's go ahead and um, heal these guys real quick. But what I want to do in this episode, and you guys were like, why didn't you do this in the last episode in the comments section? Um, we didn't really get much done in the last episode, and I realized that. And I apologize <laughs> as far as, you know, the Let's Plays of the Pixelmon and stuff like that. I guess I'm kind of a noob to it. But you guys were like, you should totally go and, you know, battle some Magikarps to level up your Pokemon. So I was thinking Metapod, which is kind of similar because they have Harden. But uh, considering that Magikarps only have Splash up into, I can't remember when they get Tackle. But basically, it'll be an even easier victory and uh, we can get some levels doing that but also what I want to do is I want to show you our penthouse for the server this is going to be our penthouse for the um, series rather and here we go let's go check it out oops oops there we go oops done <laughs> alright here we go alright so we got everything in here from we got our healer we got our own PC we got an ender chest which has nothing in it and I don't know why I have that iron door and uh, we get we got some few things from uh, some of the players on here. We got some feathers. We got some cool stuff we can sell. We have a bulldoze TM, so that's pretty cool. I don't know what we're gonna use that on, but we do have a warp board over here, our very custom warp board. And then if we go upstairs, we also have our own trade machine as well as fossil machine and some more PCs and uh, healers and all that kind of goodness. So. That with that being said, and now that you guys have seen our house that we're going to be using, let's go ahead and start leveling up these Pokemon. Le oh, I don't know why I just left. We have our warp board. Let's go back to the warp board, and um, we'll go to the biome board. Let's do that. So we'll go here, and let's go to the ocean. And let's get a couple magic carps here. Let's see if we can't find one. And I also would like to catch up a star you. If we can find a high enough magic carp, I might just go ahead and uh, capture him up because Gyarados would be a really nice addition to our collection as well so let's go ahead and we'll switch to Mudkip and we'll give Magikarp a couple couple goes here alright so we're gonna use Tackle and it's a level 14 Magikarp as well I, I don't know if level 14 has the Tackle I don't know if they get that yep as you know oh, no, that was us okay let's use Tackle again I know level 15 Magikarps get it. I'm not too sure what level they actually get it on though. So maybe we'll be good here. We'll use a couple more tackles here with Mudkip and then we're going to switch over to our Nidoran and uh, try and level that up a few as well. So we'll do one more tackle with our Mudkip and we should get a couple good levels here. So apparently level 15 is where um, the Magikarps actually get the tackle. I'm not 100% sure on that. I'm sure you guys will let me know in the comment section. But that's what I'm thinking because I just battled a level 15 off screen. And uh, it definitely had tackle. And now this one doesn't. So that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead. I don't know. I just used tackle again. Sorry. I'm going to go ahead and switch over to our, um, let's see here, Nidoran. Let's go. Let's try and uh, level this guy up a few here. And he has quite a few moves here. We got Double Kick, we got Peck, Leer, and Focus Energy. We're going to go ahead and use Peck. See what kind of damage that does. And it took off a couple hit points there. Not too bad, not too bad. Let's do Double Kick. And this is a level 11 to 14 uh, with the Magikarp level 14 there. So... Double kick two times. Bam, that took off quite a few there. We'll do Peck one more time. And if we can even get him down to just the Slither, we'll go ahead and trade over to our uh, Mudkip as well. Oh, we did. Okay, cool. So we'll go ahead. We'll get our Mudkip out and finish him off. And if we could pick up an XP share, that would really help us out as well. 
So we'll go ahead, we'll get our Mudkip. Let's do Tackle and go ahead and finish off this Magic Harp. All right, nice. Okay, we got level 6, level 7, level 8, level 9. Very nice. Okay, so we gained four levels on that little exchange there, which was pretty beast. Let's see if we can find a star you because I would not mind. Oh, I don't want to die. All right, so I don't see any star yous right now. Uh, there's one over there. Nice. I can see the outline. There's some bobbers out here. I don't know why they get so glitched out. But we got a star you over here. Where did you go? Where did you go? Oh no, I lost it. Where is it? I totally just lost that star you. There it is right there. Okay. Wow, it is dark up under here. Ooh, nice. A Cedra, I believe is what that is. We'll go ahead and go down here and we'll get this. So let's go ahead and try and battle this guy right here. We have our Mudkip level 9. Let's go ahead and use Tackle on it. We learned a new move, by the way, in the last exchange. I'm interested or curious to see what that move was. I just got a little glimpse of it. Okay, so Mud Slap. I don't know if that's really, really worth anything or if that's a good move. We're fixing to find out, though. Star, you use Tackle on Mudkip. That was pretty effective. Um, looks like we're going to have to take Mudkip probably, probably out. Uh, you know, next go. Just so I don't want him to die. Yeah, he used uh, water gun on us. Wasn't very effective considering we are water based ourselves. But I uh, did pretty pretty good damage considering that we were water based. Um, Star U level ten. We got okay. So let's go. Oh, wow, he just critical hit me. Let's go ahead and do double kick. All right, Star, you use tackle on Nidoran. Double kick, critical. Nidoran attack two times. Okay, so let's go ahead and finish him off with pack, and that should do the trick. I don't know why I just did that. We wanted to capture him. Star, you try to use tackle but missed, and there we go. We used pack, and pretty much took him right out. We got our Mudkip up to level uh, 11. We got our Nidoran up to level 13. Now we are definitely on our way to being level 15 which is what we need for our cap on the next badge or the first badge rather so we got focus energy not really not really digging that let's go ahead and uh, trade up there and I am totally done don't you die on me dude don't do it don't do it don't do it okay alright there we go now do we see any more any more star use because I would like to actually capture one up because their water gun is just absolutely beast against uh, rock type Pokemon and I don't really see one but you know what let's go and uh, capture up this Seedra here BAM and I think we probably should have healed wow we definitely probably should have healed let's just go ahead and leave oh I don't even know if he's gonna let us oh he did very nice cool Oh, no, he didn't, actually. <laughs> um, let's go ahead. We'll use double kick. Damn you. Let me escape. I'm going to go ahead and try and run again. Maybe he'll let us escape this time. There we go. All right. Screw you, Cedra. We're going to go get... We're going to go heal. That's what we need to do. And it's getting pretty dark as well. Alright guys, so we managed to get a few levels in the ocean biome. Now, uh, let's go to another biome because the ocean biome is getting a little bit stale. We got a few levels there. Uh, we could probably go back and get some more, but uh, let's go check out the jungle biome. Let's go check that out and see what we got going on over here. We got a, ooh, we got a trainer. Nice. Okay. What's up, dude? Josh. Mr. Josh with your beedrill. Alright, so we're going to do... Water gun. Nice. Mudkip got water gun. I don't know why I used it on a grass Pokemon. It's definitely not going to do much. But uh, it's nice to know that we do have that because water gun is an absolutely beast move and definitely going to be uh, a really good essential 
to have whenever we go for the uh, boulder badge. All right, so we're going to use tackle this time. Nice, that did quite a bit of damage. I'm just going to mainly con uh, focus around getting our Mudkip kind of level 15 and getting him ready for the next gym badge or the first gym badge. I don't know why I keep saying next gym badge because we haven't got one yet. All right, so Beedrill used f uh, Fury Attack on Mudkip, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, you just, you're, you're about to go down, bro. You might as well just give up. All right, there you go. He sent out Pidgey. How many Pokemon did this guy have in the beginning? I didn't even notice. I guess just that one. No? Okay. I don't know what I'm talking about here. I'm totally just all over the place, guys. I'm sorry. Um, it's been a very, very busy day. But, uh, all right. So, Mudkip used Tackle on Pidgey. Okay. There we go. We're going to use Tackle on him one more time. And then we can probably go to the hills biome and uh, maybe even the forest. I know what I want to do. Now that we have our uh, water gun move, I want to go and try and capture up a Growth because Growths are absolutely beast, and I definitely want one of them. So we're going to use, uh, let's see here, we'll use Tackle again. Is this this guy's third Pokemon? It is because we had, yes, this is definitely the third Pokemon. Come on, Josh. How many Pokemon you got in there, bro? Take him out. Definitely do not want Mudkip to faint because uh, he's going to gain quite a few levels off of this. He's already took out two Pokemon. If we can manage to take this guy out, hopefully this is Josh's last Pokemon. And um, there we go. Screw you, Josh. You have been defeated, my dude. All right, so Mudkip, level 14. So all we need to do is just level this guy up one more time, and he will be ready for the gym badge. And uh, we need to worry about Nidoran just a little bit. But, man, I'm telling you what, our stats here, he's got huge stats. He's got his happiness is 50. Uh, man, I'm telling you, we're doing pretty good here, guys. And we got moves. We got Water Gun. That's the main thing is we got Water Gun. I'm telling you, we'll get to the Boulder Badge. And um, basically, we're going to take it down with just that move right there. We won't even need to switch Pokemon. It'll just be... Critical hits all day long. Crit hits like a boss. Alright guys, so anyway, that's pretty much it for the episode. I hope you guys did enjoy. Stay tuned for next episode where we will be going to Pewter City. We'll be getting that boulder badge taken care of. And uh, that'll be one down and seven to go in our journey to get all eight. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like. That'd be absolutely awesome. And I will see your face in episode two. Peace out, guys.